Hey everyone, it's Zanef here, coming at you with another tutorial on how to use raid bots and specifically Droptimizer. What does it do? Why is it useful? How does it help me as a raider in World of Warcraft? So, we see here Droptimizer is in the top right. If we go into Droptimizer, and the Droptimizer may only be an option for the paid subscribed version of raid bots. I'm not 100% sure because I've only been on the subscribed version. Um, if it's not available to the free version, then ignore this tutorial. But, so what we've done before, we need to pull our SimC data from the game. So we're going to go into the game. We're going to do slash SimC, control C to copy, hit OK, control V to paste, paste that information, and we determine what raid, what level of difficulty we want the raid to be set to. So for me right now, probably upgrades that I'll have for my alt character is heroic. And then we can see, like, I currently have this gear on, so it's gray. Currently have this on because it's gray. Currently have this on because it's gray. But this will it'll compare all this information. Again, you can set all your simulation options. And you will hit Run Droptimizer. Now, this one takes a little while. So I've already pre-run the sim to see what it gives me. So we'll jump over to this is the final result. And what does this determine? Okay, this determines what bosses we want to use reroll tokens on, what bosses have the most upgrades, the highest percent upgrades for us. So we can see here Jade Fire Masters, 6% upgrade if I get this helmet off Jade Fire Masters. Stormwall Blockade, 5.3% DPS increase if I can get this axe. So if I just got those two pieces, then we'd be looking at close to 2,000 DPS increase for my character. Um, same thing, Champions of the Light. So it says priority number one. These bosses, they drop about, combining the three pieces of gear, a similar value of three items. So these are the bosses we want to be focusing using our rebuild tokens on in the fight or when we're doing the raid. Um, these will give you the highest increase in damage upgrades. Um, you can also see, I mean, we still have increases from these other bosses. They're not bad. You know, we've got Lady Jane of Proudmoore, so... This is going to, again, 4.4%. All these are slight upgrades from her. Um, and that's, um, I think, almost every piece of gear off of her gives me a slight upgrade. So that's also great. But highest priority is the highest damage increase. So we want to use our reroll tokens on those bosses. And then again, you can see how much of a damage increase it is, 6%. It does the breakdowns down below of all those different pieces of gear. So that's how you use Droptimizer. That's why it's beneficial. Helps you out as a raider. Right now, it's only working for um, raids. Maybe at some point in the future, they'll also set it for dungeons. So right now, you're only going to be using this to figure out what's the biggest upgrades in raid. Uh, keep in mind, you may actually have better upgrades in dungeons, in Mythic Plus dungeons, if you're looking at heroic level gear. So... That's just food for thought, but this is how you use Droptimizer, and it's an awesome tool.